Thick caterpillars have invaded a community in Dorset. Millions of brown tail moth caterpillars are causing a real issue in Portland because they cause breathing problems, as Richard Slee explains. The caterpillars are everywhere, on handrails, front gates, on the bins and up lampposts. They are literally climbing up the walls. In fact, they'll climb over anything that's been left even for just a few moments. And this is where they come from. Their favourite source of food, brambles. Their nests smothered over the surface of the bushes. Just a few metres away, Kaylee Brown is doing what she can to keep the caterpillars away from her four children. I can't even have the windows open when it's hot. I can't get out of the pram without getting them on and having to check the pram to make sure they're not on there. So I don't want my kids coming out in the rash. Beverly Leach has lived here for 31 years and never seen anything like this. Oh, it's dreadful. I can't put washing out. Um, every time you come in and out the house, the garden, everything's covered. They fall on the roof onto you. You have to check each other every time you come in and out the house to make sure you haven't got any on you. They're even falling down the chimney. People need to be aware that these caterpillars do cause skin rashes. The tiny hairs on them, when they get into the skin, will cause a nettling rash. And, it's, uh, and with that comes an intense itching, and it's very unpleasant. What are you doing to try and solve this problem? We're doing an immediate programme of some spraying, spot spraying, using an insecticide. We wouldn't normally do that, but on this occasion we need to, to take that action. Uh, we're also doing a programme of scrub management at the right time of year, in autumn and winter, to reduce the food source. And we're also going to monitor and work more closely with people to identify where the problem is during the winter months so that action can be taken earlier. These residents have at least another couple of weeks to endure this invasion of caterpillars but they hope that something will be done to prevent the same thing happening next year. Richard Slee, ITV News, Portland.